Good day viewers, I will be doing tutorials on electronics maintenance and repair. Before I proceed, my name is Charles Munikin. In addition, I am certified by certain international and internal bodies to proceed with the practice of electronics. The bodies including Fios Electronics, where I learned the basis of electronics repairs and maintenance, especially in the areas of switch power mode supply, SMPS or power pack, plasma, LED and LCD televisions, and also stabilizer, sound systems and home theaters, air conditioner, extension bulbs, extension socket, energy saving bulb and lot more, which will be talked in the forthcoming videos. This is another body called Cisco Network Academic, also where I learned essential, IT essential, which, which entails the competency of entering level PC services professional in installing, maintenance, customizing and operating personal computers, which will be taught in forthcoming videos. These are the basic electronics components that we are going to discuss in the forthcoming video. But before that, I would like to enlighten a little bit on each and every one of them. Let's start from the capacitor. This is capacitors and types. In these capacitors and types, we are also going to talk about the difference between the AC, the pure AC capacitor, and the one that also work with AC and DC, and the one that also work with DC only. We are also, we will go to discuss, we are, we are going to discuss fuse and types. You know, in fuse, we have various types of fuse. We have some fuse that can only work in DC. We, have, we also have fuse that can work in high and low tension. We can also discuss some diodes, diode types. At times, some persons or some people misuse diodes. Diode is not specified in, in a particular passive or active. Diode is depending on the usage. And that is what we are also going to discuss more on that diode. Transistors as well, being transistor types, we, we will discuss the transistor, also discuss types of transistor, MPN, PMP, MOSFET, and so on and so forth. This is also a terrestrial. A terrestrial is part of the power electronics, and which if you are if you are once an electrical electronic student, you may be hearing about this particular the particular the terrestrial. We will discuss it in full details, and I will explain it very simple and understandable to each and every one of you. In resistors also, we will discuss a resistor. We will also discuss the types of resistor. You know, there are various types of resistor and their functions. We will discuss it each and every one of them. We will also talk of, then talk on autocoupler and types. Autocoupler, the one that has four legs, eight legs, 16 legs, and so on and so forth. We are also going to discuss on transformer and type. We will talk about auto transformer, power auto transformer, and so on and so forth. In this relay, you know, relay has many functions in electronics. You can also see relay in cows and every other aspect. But the one that we are going to discuss mostly is based on electronics aspect of it. Let's talk about inductors. We will discuss inductors and various type of inductors and their various functions. You know, this is called integrated circuit or IC, abbreviation called IC. IC is another one of the important electronics component, which many people may not really understand the function of IC. But in this video, I will make it easier and simple to each and every one of you. Now, in this particular aspect, which is called electromagnet or coil, as me as a physics student in our own terms we don't call it coil we call it electromagnet 
but as a layman understanding for them to understand what we are or what you are about to discuss you will call it coil but in this electromagnet or coil we will discuss the various types of coil and how coil can be coiled to give you another different areas you know that is the way that you will recoil a coil you will have a different name for instance we have inductor inductor we are formed by coil we have a relay part of relay we are formed by coil we have transformer part of transformer we are formed by coil so what i'm trying to explain here is this in magnetic or coil you can depending on how you coil it you can get each and every one of them based on what i have just said before coil transformer or relay but it also have another function because in coil coil has so many functions in electronics you can see coil in terms of ac you, you can also see it in terms of dc the ac aspect of it should be in transformer and that transformer the area that we are going to discuss in transformer is auto transformer it's not it's not all about distribution this high tension or low tension or whatsoever i am not going to discuss that the area that i'm going to discuss in terms of transformer is called auto transformer which which is the most important thing where you can see the auto transformer in in stabilizing some system and so on and so forth you can see the practical work in this practical work work here we are going to discuss the switch power mode supplies switch power mode supplies led lcd television and so on and so forth in this practical we are going to discuss each and every one of things that is that is here we will discuss based on what is here but if maybe it could be that I might have forgotten any of them. Anyone that I might have forgotten, you will see it in the practical. But what, what I am assuring you here is this. You have seen air conditioner. Air conditioner is not a complete air conditioner. In air conditioner, we have a part where, where you can see an electronics system. So which that is the area that we are going to discuss it's not all about the complete system of air conditioner in terms of extension sockets we'll also discuss it energy saving bulb laptop desktop repairs and so many of them including the installation and configuration we will discuss it in the next coming video so this is my license to practice as technology or a scientist this is a license given to me by by annual license to practice a science laboratory technology it was given to me by sslt board from from federal investor of packard being unipol so this is a license that they gave for me and this is just to show you that i am part and parcel of a technology student thank you for watching my video